Hey guys, welcome back to my playthrough of Wolfenstein 2 The New Colossus. Uh, the last time we left off, I was kind of stuck in this train maze and couldn't find my way off this level. And so I thought I'd just do a little bit of exploring before I start recording. Turns out I don't know why I got stuck last time. This kind of happens a lot to me. But evidently I was being an idiot in some fashion because I found out where I should go like immediately after I resumed playing this game. I haven't played this for like a month, uh, not a month, maybe a week. So maybe it's the fresh perspective. But anyway, I found a way off this level. Yay me. I keep forgetting that all the time that I'm playing this game, BJ is wearing that suit. Oh, this is gonna end badly. Um, d don't worry, you know. Ah, uh, protective suit. Ignore the pain. Ain't dead. So keep moving. I completely agree hey, with Cap, you. You should know. Oh wow! Look at these stars. You see this all bright, all knowing. Oh gosh, look! What the oh, hell is going wait, on? Wait, wait. wait. Why you just left? I don't know where. If you are on Fifth Avenue, the State Building should be near. Um. Okay. We have. I see enemies. Oh well. There may be It's been a while, but do I have any I don't know handheld weapons? I mean not handheld, just the melee weapons. I want to break those boxes without alerting my enemies, but yeah, whatever. Hey, you. Oh, yeah, I got that axe. You know, everything's coming back to me. I really. One week will do a lot to my brain, apparently. I really don't remember much about. How to play this game? I remember the story fine. Hello, Danny. Looking good. Oh, that's. Okay. Well, it, in my defense, it has been a very eventful week for me. I uh, went to see a concert with a few friends. I got we got together. We. Uh, we played around for a few days, so it's been a few days off video games entirely. Let's see, Unknown Survivor's Journal. Two days since the bomb. Almost found yesterday, hide in basements. Houses collapsed, underground okay, some okay. Some filled with the dead. Sometimes bodies don't look like bodies at all. Nightmares. Sandra screaming before fire eats her, Try not to scream in sleep. Nazis in yellow plastic suits searching, killing all and everyone. Someone wrote on wall. Black Revolutionary Front. Must find. Fast. Think I have flu. Covering blood. That's not a good sign. Especially so when that's the last thing you write in the journal. Just gotta watch out for more of those Nazi, I don't know, bio engineering scientists dressed up as if they are here to make m math. Oh shit, there it is. Shit. Well, there goes all pretense.
this is not an ideal weapon for this situation. Let me just uh, switch it up. Ah, oh, shit. I forgot how much I hate drones. What the hell is he doing? Damn. This fucking machinery. These enemies are not hard, but they're giving me kind of a hard time because they're well hidden. I'm only just one guy. Shooting him in the dick. That's my that's my plan. Shooting them in the dick constitutes as like at least 80% of my plan. Overall. Yeah, I got it. No, you don't need backup. You, you guys, you got, I'm just one person. You guys got it. Okay, I might be dressing up like Iron Man right now. So that's, that probably strikes fear into the heart of criminals or whatever. But still. What, what happened to the REM pride? Another one? Seriously? Ooh, I actually got it. Well, I'm just gonna sit here and wait for him to pop up his head. There you are. There we go. Oh shit. Ha! You tried to blast me with your explosive self, but I. But I made you. Yeah. I'm going for the economic way. From now on, no wasted bullets. Every. Bullet fired that doesn't immediately result in a Nazi dead is a wasted bullet. And where are we going? You know, it's been a while since I played this, so I don't re even remember what. BJ's immediate objective is. I left him off in the subway. Well, but what was he doing there? I completely don't remember. I'm kind of relying on the plot to fill me in on that one. <laughs> Son of a bitch! Is it officer? showed me postcards from your family in New York City. Wanted to go there, 
Just you and me. Aw, BJ, you know what? That's where we have in common. I want to go to New York City too. And also with your mama. Oh, I'm overloading myself. So, the first to go obviously is to find a way off this rack. Looks like a wall that's destructible. You know what? M maybe I forgot something. Maybe I have uh, some weapon that can do that. Um. Okay, evidently not. So that was worth a try. I think. There we go. Hello, big boy. Come to test the old man's metal. What the shit is that? Okay. Oh, fuck me. Don't get stuck, don't get stuck, not now. This is a very bad time to get stuck. Not that there's any good time to do so, but this is especially the bad time. Shit. Hey, what is this, safe haven? I can still shoot at the feet. I wonder if I'm doing anything. Oh, I am doing something. This is great. Yeah, back away, you idiot. You know better than to tank with me. Oh, there he is back. I'm just gonna shoot at these legs, see if I can like really do some real damage. Jesus! Yeah, you can do that all day long. That's not gonna hit me, like, at all. Intimidation, maybe! But no real effect. Joke's on you, big boy. Aha! What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? God damn it. Ah, limited ammo. Just gonna ceremoniously shoot you in the head. Wow, that actually worked. I 
I didn't cheat in this game, but I feel like I just did. I feel like my guts are falling out. No, it's well, it can't. It it's this guy's guts that's hanging out. So you're in a better shape than this thing. So yeah, victory. We just killed one big boy. Oh, so I guess I could have used this thing. Well, why would I do that? Well, I had a, a complete safe haven. What, what is this cookbook recipe for sauerkraut burger? Wow. Fry or grill or patty of ground hamburger meat. Uh, yada yada yada. Someone has scribbled the yum. Must make this in German in the margins of this page. Well, better get that back to the wife. And has anybody actually tried to make that? I don't know if that's a real recipe or not. It'd be great if that's a real recipe and somebody makes it and it's actually really delicious. That would be good. Broadcasting alarm. Oh shit. Ow. Oh well. You asked for it. I hear doggies. Sorry puppy. Just your master is kind of a bitch. All right. Since I didn't use this weapon at all against the big boss, I guess for the moment that makes me kind of overpowered against these, well, cannon folders. There's nothing wrong with being overpowered. Nice. Should get to work on upgrading my weapons. Oh yeah. That sounds like a real good idea. Woohoo! Find a way to reach the top of the state building and make contact with the resistance group. Look for elevators, stairs, anything. The radiation levels should be acceptable at the top of the building. Oh yeah, locate the uh, oh, boy, local resistance group. Never That's the mission. A glory. BJ's ever the poet, ever the romantic. You wouldn't think that of BJ uh, Black Squiz as that kind of character before they made a new order. You sure you wanna tangle with this? Oh, ho, ho, ho. this thing may be too much for you guys to handle. Oh shit! Well, they do get the drop on me very occasionally. What am I supposed to do with the Enigma machine?
Oh wow. Oh, that's where I should go. Shit. You almost made me sweat. Almost. You were just kind of relevant. What do you mean empty? Well, let's advance the plot a little bit. What say you? No, 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 I am not a Nazi. I'm not a Nazi, okay? You ain't a white-ass fascist Nazi pig, then you either colored or you're a deviant. Are you sure as hell ain't colored, so you're trying to pass as a deviant? He look like a deviant to you, Sister Grace? Nope. Hang on, hang on. I may not be a deviant. God, I told you he's a goddamn Nazi! Oh, wow. Fuck this. Oh, fucker! <laughs> Let me say this again. I ain't no goddamn Nazi. Hey! Now you bring Super Special back in and you put him down right now. Or I will shove this grenade so far up your ass, I'll be dancing and rejoicing as your entrails trickle down from the ceiling. You dig, man? No, I don't dig, man. I got precious little time for your bullshit. We've been trying to make contact with your group. We're organizing for a revolution in America. We? The Chrysal Circle. Especially escort this motherfucker inside the house and get him a hot meal. Let me put this pen back in. Shit! Ah, oh, you fucking kid! How do you guys survive this long? Take cover! <laughs> Relax, man. He's just a duck. Oh, bitch got a sick sense of humor. Uh, yep. Dude, you're crushing me! Oh, oh. Chili, you okay? My papa's recipe. I got no spoon though. Hey, I got a recipe. I picked it's for a burger. So what's uh with the chicken fats? Chicken fats. That's that's my Faraday cage, man. You, you dig? It, it keeps the, the Nazi alien conspiracy from finding us. I almost got killed by William Goddamn Blaskowitz. Oh no, he's a fan. <laughs> Is that good for the baby? You were here when the bomb hit. Yeah, I was. I survived. Okay, never mind. That's the last thing to worry about. Look like a vision out of Dante's Inferno. You know what I'm saying? I remember main people just wandering through the smoke. I remember screams echoing through the bombed-out buildings like howling ghosts. I remember this mother and son. This boy was blindly stumbling through the chaos. His arms were outstretched, calling out for his mama. And the heat from the bomb had melted the skin on his arms, and they just drooped. Like he was wearing a shirt that was a couple of sizes too big. And I remember his mama. She was crawling to get to him. And the half of her body was all gone. It was just gone. 
Well, that's no good. What are you thinking in a moment like that? When you know you're losing everything you love. What are you thinking in a moment like that, huh? Eh, no gonna be noticeable. Not monsters. Men. Ah, same thing. Look, I'm sorry for your loss, Mr. Blaskowitz. For a little I spoke with Caroline, she seemed like a hell of a woman. She had balls of steel. Balls. Why is it that balls are always used as some fucking default definition of bad assery? Small, little, delicate things. Resting all snug and warm and cozy and comfortable in their little wrinkly wrapper of fucking skin. Hey, you made your point. <laughs> that is a mystery. <laughs> you know what? She's What's got not a point. A is the sweet juice they produce. Okay, we're gonna. A couple of my own on the way. Instead of balls allegory, we're gonna use tits from now on. How's that sound? Sorry. <laughs> what are you sorry for? What's up, special? There's pigs, lots of them coming up the stairs. They're like a fucking army. Shh. Fuckers found us. Well, you got an escape strategy, Mr. Blaskowitz? Anya, we're gonna need immediate evac. Understood, William. Dispatching has one and has two for immediate extraction. Copy. Move your people to the roof. I'll stall the Nazis until our ride's here. Brothers and sisters, listen up! I need everybody to get up to the roof now. We're evacuating. And bring all the equipment you can carry. Come on, let's hustle, people! Come on, come on. Get your shit. Bring all the snacks. Bring all the recipes. You Make sure your people make it out. Oh yeah, we are a one-man defense. Get me, you white ass fascist Nazi pig. That's right. BJ doesn't even give a fuck right now. Wow, you actually hit through that. I'm impressed. Wow. Uh, that, that's not good. That's not good. I got killed real fast. But hey, you know what? It's worth it. No, it's not worth it. What the fuck just happened? What the hell are you guys doing? I didn't get a single shot out. What the fuck? Uh, you know what? You know what? I'll take it. Like, as if I had any other choice. Oh, that's right. I may... Uh, no, that's not the best. Oh, so that's what happened. Gotta be fucking kidding me. Under heavy fire! I thought I saw a fucking health pack out there. You know, 50 health, 50 health is really just killing me. Is there any way I can level that up? I don't know, do I have, uh... I can upgrade my weapons, sure. Maybe I should do that.
Damn, I'm kind of bad at this. Ah, I backed myself into a corner. That's just great. And I'm taking cover uh, uh, against something that's totally flammable and combustible. That's very clever of me. Shit. Ah, fuck me! Thought it was just a dark room. How was I supposed to know? What was that anyway? Why, why is there a death trap in this room? I hate fucking drones! I don't know, every time something just hits me and drains my health really quickly. I need that drone to die! Hey! Don't you dare turn your back from me! What the hell? As far as I'm concerned, I, I took one shot. I think I did pretty good, all things considered. Okay, you. Fucking hell. Just have to try again. And then try again, and then try many more times. Fuck! You fucking kidding me? There are two of them. Uh. Oh my god. I I don't know how to do that. I don't have a plan. They're, they're giving me gasoline, so there must be a super weapon of some sort that I 
that I can find around this place. L let me just read the letter. Clarence's letter. Hi, sweetheart. I sit here under the shade of the big palm tree writing this letter to you. I know another letter from the front. I just want to let you know how much I miss you guys back home, how much I wish this was a vacation instead of fighting Nazis, and that you and little Angela were here with me, basking in the sun. You know, it's quite beautiful here on this island where I'm uh, stationed. You got me the uh, you got the emerald colored waters, long stretches of blinding white sand beaches, blue skies as far as you can see, the long line of next text redacted, and it's right in front of me. They said we have to move out soon and again, I don't know where, but the Germans are pushing the front line and we have to stop them or else, who will? Anyway, how's my sweet little angel? I miss that pretty face of hers, I miss the laugh I got every time I tickle her belly, I miss it all, take care baby. You know, people who live in this universe, they, uh, they've been facing this since the original uh, Nazi takeover from, from like the real history time, from 1930s to 1940s and then they go beyond the in-universe uh, date for this game would be something like uh, 1960s so technically there's a lot of people who who were born in this universe who never knew anything other than uh, a world of Nazis ah there's just no fucking way to hide Guess you just gotta keep moving. Come on! I'm doing my best here. I know my best isn't a lot. Frankly, I suck at aiming at anything with a controller. How come they always see me first? Ah, and it takes. The fucking armor that takes so much shit. Gotta watch out for the big robot guy coming this way. Shit! Fuck! He was like so far away the last time I checked on him. This is not fair. That was the only place where I can even remotely survive. God fucking damn it. This is the entire episode. Just getting through this one fucking level. If you can call this a level. This is the most annoying thing ever since Hades even got a war. And I don't mean Hades as a boss character. In God of War 3, that shit was easy. I mean Hades the level in God of War 1. If you haven't played that game, if you, you're familiar with... If you know what I'm talking about, I know you agree with me. Because that level is bullshit. Shit! Okay. Machine gun isn't cutting it. I'm switching weapon. Hopefully, the uh, this one will prove more efficient.
Well, it definitely kills the enemy quicker. Wow. Wait. Ah, oh, I forgot how to use that thing. It's been too long since I played this game. I forgot. But that's okay. I, I uh, did better this time, so that's a good start. I uh, got. I forgot that the we that weapon was about. You, you had to detonate it manually. I, I totally forgot about that. And I was wondering why it's not doing anything to him because it wasn't blowing up. Wow, this thing is a killer against the drones. I like it. You know, it's just very unfair that I'm the one that's left behind to protect everyone so they can retreat. I mean, we're not even in the same unit. I don't even know those fuckers. Okay, be with you in a moment. Yeah, you just wanted to die so fucking urgently. God damn it. Use up. Did it? Wow. Wow. Well, don't really need this anymore. Another angel. Ah, shit. I really need to, like, fucking have a refresh uh, on the controls of this game because I don't remember a lot of it. Giving in. See, I guess they don't have the fighting spirit no more. Nah, they just do whatever the fucking Fuhrer tells them to do. That's baloney. They want to fight the Nazis just as much as we do. All they need is for someone to show them how. You know who's running the South after the Nazis took over? The Ku Klux motherfucking Klan, am I right? That's it. So what you gonna do? You gonna go down there and hold hands with them and build bridges and persuade them to join our cause? Get your head out your ass, Blazkowicz. Forget about the turncoats. Focus on the grassroots. I'm running on empty. Don't know how much time I got. Can't even stand up on my own accord no more. I've seen worse. 
Maybe you're right. Maybe the American people grew comfortable living under tyranny. Maybe the Nazis will still be running the show after I kick the bucket. Sister Grace is always right, brother. I learned that the hard way. I don't know. But I know this. You take freedom away from the American people, you're playing with fire. And I intend to pour some gasoline. People gotta know they don't have to take this shit no more. And if nothing else, that's what I'm gonna do before I go. See, that's what I'm talking about, Blaskowitz! You wanna strike fear in the Nazis? You wanna hit them hard for all to see? You wanna cause some real motherfucking havoc? Well, then you come to the right woman. So if you still got some Nazi fighting, killing skills up in you, then guess what? I got a plan that's gonna send shockwaves throughout the nation. Oh, shit! Is this the one where I go home to Roswell? Show you right! <laughs> what do you think about this, Schmendrick? I think I got you now, my little goylem. Thanks, Hoss. I don't know, Maxilla. Well, 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 so this is where all the decisions are made. We're gonna need a place to sleep nearby. This room looks empty. Super Smash! Hey, white boy, I'm gonna need a new home for my people. Power outlets, radio room access, and a can. You got it? Yes, ma'am. Heck yes. What's up, boss? We sleeping in here. You got it, sister. All right, listen up, people. White boy here is gonna show you where to set up shop. After that, I want you to look around, find a place to bunk, get to know the boat folk. And hey, best behavior, you dig? This way. You got nukes on? He's happy. Yes, we do. There's a stockpile of nuclear warheads downstairs in Section F. We need to get our hands on one of those. But we've sealed up the entrance to Section F. Because it's been flooded since the attack. Blast Woods, you know how to swim? Yep. Have the operative. What the fuck is this? I said, what the fuck? What the fuck is this, man? Is this a working toilet I see before me? Handle toward my hand? Yes. Yes, this toilet can handle all sorts of waste, feces, urine, vomitus, you name it. Do you have ass wipe? By that you mean toilet paper, yes. And of course, we need to mind our rations a little bit, but there's oh. ass wipe in there. Oh, God. Oh, my God. Okay, yes. I don't want to know how. I don't want to know how you've been doing. All these years. <laughs> okay. Okay. I'm just gonna be in here for a minute. Good luck. It strikes me that I haven't been appreciative enough of these little good things in life. Think you smiled, huh? Hmm. I don't know. I think he's doing pretty good. Is that a legal move? No, no. Hmm. I'm just gonna stand here and watch them do this for a little while. Max sauce. Um, Max? I'm starting to see why you're winning. Damn. Doc? Just Jesus. Calm the fuck down. It wasn't even the real game. Oh well. Hey, what you got there? Oh, he's gonna start painting. That's right, Max. I completely agree with you. I don't know what you just said, but I agree with it. Ah, <sighs> this bitch. This bitch. Hello, mister. Hi. It's so nice just to wander around. I don't have any Nazi to kill. That guy is 
still in the fucking toilet. How are you doing? We need that nuclear warhead from section F. Hey, hey, hey. Okay. Let me have my vacation. How's that nuclear warhead coming along? We need it. Anya said there was a stockpile in section F. I didn't even leave the room yet. How do you think it's coming along? Everyone is so demanding. Hi there. Hello, Hibleskovich. Anya gave me this workstation so I would not be completely useless, as she said. But <laughs> it was broken. <laughs> she, did she literally say that? Herr Bombote here said that he could fix my problem. Which problem so are we uh, yeah. talking about? Hey, what did you promise her? Oh, I saw the new post came from Manhattan. Can't see shit. I didn't think anyone had survived the atom bomb. Mother told me there were no survivors. All combat simulations. I don't know if I need any simulations, you know. Awakening. Freedom Chronicles. That's uh, that's DLC, right? You know what? Another time. I got a mission. So that arm freed's letter. Mother uh, Albert, mother told me you got a station at the Osmizer. What an honor to serve General Angle. And the quartermaster of all things. Don't really know who you but who you buttered up to get that assignment, but take this seriously, please. No more incidents like last time. I will always look after my little brother, but I can't bail you out every time you fumble. Mother is so proud that both her sons are fighting the good fight against the terror, keeping our rights safe. The kids say hi as well, asking when they can see their Uncle Albie again. Send me a message when you know you are back in the fatherland. Best of luck. Yeah, well, bad people also have families. What can you do? The fuel is our guiding light. 20th, I guess that's October 1960, Los Angeles. Yesterday, D. Nuren Ward, I, I don't know how to pronounce that, sat down for an in an interview with TV producer August Schmeling at the LA Media Tower during his busy schedule recording the latest episode of The Blitzmatch, the most popular adventure show on far and Scion television in the American territories. I believe Blitzmatch provides an important moral message that resonates with our times. Here, Schmeling tells us in between sips of strong German coffee, the people of the American territor territories have been liberated from the demons of the past, capitalism and the cultural decadence, and entering a new golden era of prosperity. Our show helps people make peace with their brutal past. Concerning the incredible art direction of his show, here Schmeling only have this to say, to say, Our beloved Führer is our guiding light in everything. This show would not have been possible without him. can't really say that it would be possible. He's not wrong in that regard. Crazy Rebel Amps Journal. We're all going to die. I can feel it. No sleep for days. Dreams have become fragmented. Violent. Strange. Helen's face crops up every time. Bloody half of it missing. Wake up screaming. No sleep. Fuck sleep. First time writing since forever. Maybe it helps clear my mind. Stop talking to the others in the Crystal Resistance. Can't stand their looks, their voices. Safe? Inside a Nazi's own fucking boat? Sure, Black Squid stole it, but how can we be sure there's no spy equipment installed somewhere? Okay, you know what? I, we got better than that. We actually have a whole section full of Nazis still living there. So, that's something. No one answers. No one thinks. Caroline said I'm being too negative. Asked me to contribute with positive energy to the cause. I said, fuck the cause. Humanity's down for it. The Nazis won. It's over. They fucking won. Found a spot now away from the others, making myself a home. Away from the people. Away from... Malnourished faces and a sickly stares looking back at me, like kind of mirrors. Maybe it's time I sleep now, but I can't. Too afraid of my dreams. M. Where is this M? 
And it's certainly not a good thing to be reading other people's diaries. But I'm reading more. <laughs> Commandant Fisher's note, keep your voices down. Man, when we talk in here, we talk using small words. We do not want to risk any sound of us being here, leaking out into the other parts of the submarine. Just think what would happen if he comes in here. I do not need to remind you what happened last time. It was a right slaughter. I'm trying to send some kind of message to the Auburn Commando, where we are so, uh, where we are, so they can rescue us. Until then, everyone sit calm and quiet and do not rock the boat. Communication using written notes. Use voice only if you absolutely have to. Pass this note along, Commander Fisher. These are the uh, hidden Nazis on the boat. Frank's postcard. My dearest Hans, you should see this. The American colonies is a paradise. I'm staying at a hotel in Honolulu. It's beautiful and the locals are friendly to me. The glory of the Reich has truly blessed, is truly, has truly blessed this place. Still, when I take the girls out to the harbor to buy ice cream and, all I see, and I see all the U-boats and the ships coming back to port, I think of you, my love. Remembering how proud you were when you got a station on Eva's hammer. I hope you are safe out there and that I can be in your arms again soon. The girls wonder if you have seen a mermaid yet. I miss you, all oh my love, Franca. A little bit of a human side of the bad guys. Oh, nobody's 100% a dick, but you still gotta die. So. We are talking about what, what was it, the fifth sector or something like that? Locked. How can things be locked from me? Did you see the new kill house set built in the shooting range? I tried it. But my time was like toilet. Hey, how, how's the piggy? Hey there. Is this? This is Bomb Bombati's room. Chad back down to the hidden entrance in the locker room. Grace needs a nuclear warhead from the stockpile in Section F. Yeah, I'm gonna get her, her nuclear warhead. Don't worry about that. People here are so demanding. They want nuclear warheads. William. Hey, babe. The twins are kicking again. I think they can sense when you're near. Maybe we can get some time alone? Just hey, you and me? We are alone now. I would like that. <laughs> the belly kicking has gotten stronger since you woke up, William. I think they're excited to meet you. Oh, that's nice. I have them on the on the shelf right here. I, I don't have a camera here, so I can't show you, but it's like right behind me. I, I'm holding it right now in my hands. Wolfenstein, young blood. I'm looking at the twins right now. BJ, you got you got a pair of beautiful girls. I just don't know if you survived the whole thing. I hope you do. I really don't know what happens in this game, and I don't want to know until I find out in my own course. Brave face, old man. Keep away. What she needs, you can't provide. Are we talking about Arnia or this is Wyatt's room? Hey, Doc! Doc, if you're. What is going on? Set's note concerning Caroline's parachute. Oh, that's my suit now. This armor Caroline wears is, I must say, beyond fascinating. Such detail, such craftsmanship, almost a flawless in ex execution. A truly fantastic example of dad issued engineering. I can't even stop looking at it whenever I'm around Caroline. Well, well, created maybe around the 18th century, very difficult to pinpoint exact date. I did hear about this when I was a little boy chick, from stories told by the elders. 
Even a klutz could wear this and become the greatest athlete in the world. The engineers had, encrypt, had encrypted the messages inside the lining of the suit, which I have been trying to decipher. But I have Bob. But I have Bobkin so far. Anyway, we'll return to it one day if I have the time. It's my suit now. Just gonna walk around, meet all the people, see what everyone is up to. Hey. Hey. What smell is that? Boldo was in the corridor by the cantina when he smelled a foul stench. I thought Boldo told you when you were working in the hangar, my friend. No. Boldo was silent as a mouse. He usually is around me. I tried telling him the story of how I survived the Normandy massacre. But I might as well have been talking. How long do you feel like you need to shake those dices? We sealed the section off. Because of a Hello to you, Captain. Hello. I remember someone was like living around this area. Yeah, we picked up some potatoes. I don't know for what. Hey, Maria. Hello, um, are are you the uh, M in that letter? Ça va bien, Captain Blaskovitz. Ah, uh, ça va très bien, merci. Okay, this is new. Commandant Fisher's note. Oscar, I will tell you my solution to the American terrorist problem. It is of course very very unlikely to happen, but we nevertheless need a fallback plan in case the terrorist strikes. If a scenario as you described should happen, we would need access to food supply, ammunition, and radio equipment to contact the Ober Commando. Therefore, I spoke with Axel. He recommends Section F. What you need to do is make preparations for this base to be used as our fallback plan. When you when you are down, I expect you to hold a briefing for the men so everyone is clear what to do. How he, how Hitler, Commander Fisher. So they made some kind of, oh shit, not this again. So they made some kind of uh, preparation in Section F, which incidentally is the exact place that I'm trying to get to. Where is it anyway? So oh, the map isn't telling me where the objective is. Oh shit. Okay, let's see. Helm. Cantina. For section F. I believe his time in Kill House would be the very fantastic one. BJ and Anya, yay, there's a heart here. Maybe it's over here. This place looks kind of mysterious. Hello, Captain. Yeah, why are you. Oh. This is Section F. I always feel like that guy is like committing suicide or something. Grace, you read? 
Going fishing for that nuclear warhead now. Got it. Keep me posted. Right. Right. We're gonna be meeting some enemies here. We're gonna be killing Nazis on our own boat. This is where I came from, isn't it? They're still your unborn babies. Don't forget about them. Oh, shit. Fucking drones, I swear to God. Blaskowitz, got a heads up for you. Looking at the engineering map, there seems to be a defense system guarding the nuclear warhead stockpile. I count one, three, four, five, hibernation sarcophagi in the vicinity. Be ready for anything. Brace out. That's great. That's just great. This defense mechanism, does it happen to look like a, just a robot or something like that? Can't see shit. Need some light in here. Yep, let's just bring the trap. Oh, Jesus. Anymore? Um, okay. I'm going down. Don't surprise me. Hmm. 
It sounds so scary. Now where am I going? Can't get in here. I don't think I'm supposed to drop under that thing. Oh yeah. to get there Okay, I'm stuck again. Where am I supposed to go? Does that machine have anything to do with it? Looks like some place you can go, but you can't. And I'm guessing these are the warheads that I'm supposed to take, but how do I do it? So right now we just need to advance 
to this level. I'm thinking we already completed a mission. Like, this is not... This shouldn't be hard anymore. We already did a hard thing. We, we killed the enemies. Right now, it should be a matter of just taking the missile. And... I can't really find out where that is. I have gone through everywhere I can go. Several times. I have to be missing something. I don't know what. Let me leave that to the next episode. Yeah, it seems like I'm gonna end with e end every episode with me being stuck on somewhere, but it'll always work out. It always does in the end. So thanks for watching. This has been Wolfenstein to the New Colossus. The game so far has been amazing, and I can't wait to find out what happens to BJ. Uh, so yeah, thanks for watching, and uh, I'll see you next time. Until then, have a good one.